This is uh, in response to David Duke Moscow's speech too. Um, you're going to be surprised about what I'm going to say. Uh, some people are going to be very surprised by what I'm going to say because I'm not going to sit here and rip apart his speech. Actually, um, I'm going to have to concede something that I've noticed. Um, David Duke mentioning um, the concept of racial preservation, um, the concept of uh, eugenics. I don't say necessarily the concept of eugenics, but the concept of concept of um, opposing interracial marriage, definitely, to preserve your race is not something I heard first from a white person. I actually actually heard it from a black person and this black person was opposing interracial marriage based on the concept especially in America because um, they wanted to preserve the black race so this notion that whites whites are only opposed to interracial marriage to preserve their racial identity uh, that's not true there are black people and I've heard I don't know the quote but it was said that Louis Farrakhan opposed interracial marriage because he felt that it would destroy the black race in terms of its um, uniqueness. So, if whites are a world minority and they believe that all these immigrants are going to interracially mix with whites, I can see to a point where they can exert that they will be destroyed as a physical racial group. Now let's be honest here. Would blacks, if blacks can sit there and say, we can, we we are opposed to interracial marriage because we want to preserve our race because we are a minority in America. If whites are a minority in the global scale, then they're going to say they then they can logically say, we oppose, we want to control interracial marriage because we want to preserve our racial identity. So that's going to be a surprise. I'm sure that you thought that I was going to come here and just rip apart his argument. Now, I want to make it perfectly clear that I'm not opposed to interracial marriage because I do not see race as a... I don't see race as a major importance from my perspective. Okay. But if you're going to have black nationalism that says that we oppose interracial marriage because we feel that it will destroy our race or destroy the concept of our race, then white nationalists are going to be equally qualified to say that we oppose interracial marriage because we feel that it's going to destroy the integrity of our race. I don't agree with any of these things, but I can't sit here and... and um, bash David Duke for saying it without bashing uh, black nationalists from saying it. So that's just my opinion. I mean you can take it for what it's worth and it, you also have to take into account that interracial marriage is not necessarily a trade of economic and cultural power in any uh, way or form so you have to also take that into account. So that's my food for thought. Thanks.